Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Bismillah Rahim. This is the third video of this series and here we will be uh, talking about series parallel uh, resonance circuit, series parallel combination actually. So you can see from this diagram that this has the two uh, arms or two elements in parallel with this inductor in series. Similarly here we have this and this two parallel but this is a first of all a combination or series and then it is parallel so that is why these two circuits are series parallel combinations. So let's jump into the problem solving. So this is the question determine the resonant frequency for the circuit and as we discussed this is a series parallel combination these two arms are in parallel with these two in series so series parallel combination and therefore we cannot use this formula omega is equal to 1 over under root lc for this case so we have to find another technique let's write the input impedance y is if you recall this was the formula we found in the previous video in the parallel circuit 1 over j omega s plus j omega c plus 1 over j omega l. Now here these two terms are same but this right one is uh, different we have to modify. So this is for the c, this is for r and this is for the uh, this term uh, j uh, 2 plus j omega 2. So 2 plus j omega 2 instead of j omega l. And from here we can simplify this. We, we want to get rid of this j. So multiply uh, numerator and denominator by 2 minus j omega 2. So now j is gone from here. And now we separately write these two. So it will become like this. 2 is separated. And now we take the j terms, this and this together. So this is the j terms. And uh, we know that at resonance, the uh, imaginary y has to be 0. That means this term has to be 0. So we put this equal to 0. And from here, we calculate the value of omega naught. So by manipulation, and I hope you can follow this. So omega naught comes to be 2 radians per second. So this is how you solve the series parallel problems to find the resonant circuit. So let's see the practice. This is the practice problem. Now here again uh, we have these two in parallels combined with a series. So we have to again we, this does not apply. So let's find out the uh, admittance. So admittance will be uh, this one and the modification of these two sorry not uh, first of all we are solving this this for y1 <coughs> these two parallels so for this we will find y1 so y1 is this term j omega uh, 0 0.5 and 1 over 20 solving we come to this and again uh, now we find the impedance because we have to add with this so let's call this as impedance z1 which is 1 over y1 so we inverse this and now the total impedance will be the add, adding this with z1 so this is the total impedance z omega and uh, 10 millihenry and z1 plug again the value of z1 and then as we did in the previous case we want to get rid of j from here so we multiply numerator and denominator by 1 minus this term so now j is gone from the denominator and separately writing the two terms so this is the term 
and again now we we were here so now we'll equate the uh, or we take the j terms at one side and take j common from here so we take j common so this becomes the term and it has to be equal to zero at resonance imaginary z has to be equal to zero so this term will become zero and from here step by step if you solve you can i guess follow this then the value of omega naught comes to be 435.9 you could have written omega naught right from here uh, right from at this point but it doesn't matter even if you write at the end so i hope this gives you an understanding as to how to solve the combination circuit series parallel combination circuit Thank you.